Everyone thinks Prince Harry's fiancée Meghan Markle is Canadian, but she's totally American. Ever since Meghan Markle was thrust into the international spotlight as Prince Harry's girlfriend and now fiancée, she's been associated with Canada. The adorable prince frequently traveled to Toronto to visit her there. She filmed her hit show Suits in the Canadian city. Heck, she was even a focal point of the 2017 Invitus Games in the Northern Country. But make no mistake, the gorgeous actress is an American through and through. Scroll down to read more facts about Meghan. What is Meghan Markle's nationality? Meghan is American. She was born and raised in L.A., where she attended Immaculate Heart High School before going to Northwestern University near Chicago. Though she grew up in the States, Meghan has spent plenty of time in different parts of the world. During college, she interned at the U.S. Embassy in Buenos Aires, Argentina, and in 2016 she traveled to Rwanda for the Clean Water Campaign and Madrid, Spain for an extended vacation. Plus, there was that romantic two-week trip to Botswana with boyfriend Harry in 2017. So, you could call her a citizen of the world, but she's still an American citizen on paper. What is Meghan Markle's ethnicity? Meghan is stunningly beautiful, and her racial ambiguity makes her even more interesting and mysterious. However, her ethnicity is no secret. My dad is Caucasian, Dutch, and Irish, and my mom is African American, she once revealed to Elle. I have come to embrace this and say who I am, to share where I'm from, to voice my pride in being a strong, confident, mixed race woman. Are Meghan and Prince Harry engaged? Yes. Harry popped the question to Meghan in November 2017 in London and the royal's father, Prince Charles, confirmed the news in an official statement on Monday, November 27. His Royal Highness the Prince of Wales is delighted to announce the engagement of Prince Harry to Ms. Meghan Markle. The wedding will take place in spring 2018. Further details about the wedding day will be announced in due course, the message read. In their official engagement interview, Harry and Meghan dished even more details on the special proposal. It was just a typical night for us, Harry said, to which Meghan replied, what were we doing? Just roasting chicken? Trying to roast a chicken and it was just an amazing surprise. It was so sweet and natural and romantic. He got on one knee. Harry continued, she didn't even let me finish. Then there were hugs and I had the ring on my finger and I was like, can I give you the ring? So it was a really nice moment it was just the two of us and I think I managed to catch her by surprise as well. Has Meghan met Queen Elizabeth? Yes. In their engagement announcement, Prince Charles confirmed that Harry informed Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth and other close members of his family soon after his proposal to Meghan. Prior to getting engaged, Harry reportedly introduced Meghan to his famous grandmother during an informal visit to Buckingham Palace. It's believed the meeting was held in the Queen's private sitting room at around 5 p. M. And Prince Philip was not in attendance. It is the Queen's favorite part of the day and she loves it when her grandchildren are able to join her. She normally sits for half an hour eating from a selection of sandwiches, fruit or plain scones and cake, a source revealed. The Queen spent almost an hour with her grandson and the lawborn Meghan. Insiders say that Harry had spoken to his grandmother during the summer at Balmoral asking to introduce Meghan, the insider added. During their engagement interview, Harry and Meghan confirmed the actress has met the monarch. It's incredible to be able to meet her through Harry's lens, Meghan dished. Not just with his honor and respect for her as the monarch, but the love that he has for her as his grandmother. All of those layers have been so important to me. She's an incredible woman. Most importantly, the Queen's corgis already love Meghan. The corgis took to you straight away, Harry teased Meghan during their engagement sit-down. I've spent the last 33 years being barked at, this one walks in, absolutely nothing. Meghan then admitted, that's true. They were just laying on my feet during tea, it was very sweet. Though it was previously rumored that Queen Elizabeth would skip Harry and Meghan's upcoming nuptials because Meg is a divorcee, it has since been suggested that both the Queen and Prince Philip will attend the special event. How old is Meghan? Meghan was born on August 4, 1981 which makes her 36 years old today. Interestingly, Meg is three years older than her royal fiancé, Harry, who is only 33. Where does Meghan live? Meghan was living in Toronto because that's where she filmed Suits, but she recently left the show after seven seasons. Now that she's engaged to Harry, Meghan will be moving to London to reside with her fiancé in their Nottingham cottage at Kensington Palace. What is Meghan's real name? 
Like many celebrities, Meghan uses a stage name rather than the one she was given at birth. However, it's really not that far off from her real one. While her middle name really is Meghan, her first is Rachel. Yes, like the name of her suit's character, Rachel Zane. What is Meghan's net worth? Meghan's estimated net worth is $7 million. She previously earned around $50,000 per episode on Suits and made $80,000 per year on other endorsement deals as an actress. Harry is worth a whopping $40 million from his royal trust and inheritances. They make quite the impressive duo, don't they? What are Meghan's other acting credits? Though Meghan's most famous acting role has been playing Rachel Zane on Suits, the star has additionally appeared on TV shows General Hospital, CSI, Miami, 90,210, Castle, and Fringe, and even once worked as a briefcase girl on the game show Deal or No Deal. She's also appeared in movies Get Him to the Greek, Remember Me, and Horrible Bosses and has starred in two Hallmark Channel movies, When Sparks Fly and Dater's Handbook. Did Meghan retire from acting? Yes, she did. Following her engagement to Prince Harry, Meghan confirmed she is stepping away from Hollywood to instead focus on her royal duties and humanitarian efforts. I don't see it as giving anything up. I just see it as a change, Meghan said. It's a new chapter, right? And also, keep in mind, I've been working on suits for seven years. We were very, very fortunate to have that sort of longevity on a series. I've ticked this box, and I feel very proud of the work I've done there, and now it's time to work with Harry as a team. Who are Meghan's parents? Meghan has some amazing parents that Harry will be so lucky to soon have as in-laws. Her psychotherapist and yoga instructor mom is Doria Ragland, who is brilliant and has a master's degree from the University of Southern California. Her dad is Thomas W. Markle, an Emmy-winning lighting director that worked on Married. With children. He's the one who sparked Meghan's love for acting, since he brought her on set a lot when she was young. Doria and Thomas are now divorced. Does Meghan have siblings? Yes, Meghan has two older half-siblings from her dad's first marriage. Meghan's half-brother, Thomas Jr., is 15 years older than the star. Meghan is said to still be relatively close to Thomas, 50, despite his run-in with the law, and the fact that he regularly shares intimate details about his sister's romance with Harry. Meghan's half-sister, Samantha Grant, 52, is a former actress and model. Samantha is now a mother of three, lives in Florida, and is wheelchair-bound after she was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis in 2008. In the past, Samantha has publicly criticized Meghan, alleging that she is a social climber. Was Meghan married before? Yes, Meghan was in a relationship with Hollywood producer Trevor Angelson from 2004 until 2011. The former couple tied the knot in Jamaica surrounded by a small group of family and friends on Sept. 10, 2011. In August 2013, Meghan and Trevor divorced after nearly three years of marriage. Does Meghan have any hidden talents? Surprisingly, yes, she does. Meghan is a total foodie and loves to cook. In fact, she and Harry were making roast chicken at home when the prince popped the question how perfect is that? When once asked what five items she always keeps in her fridge, Meghan revealed, hummus, carrots because I love them and so does my dog, bogart a green juice, almond milk, and a chia seed pudding. She is also talented at calligraphy and once actually made money with the interesting skill. I used to be a calligrapher for weddings and events that was my side job while I was auditioning for acting jobs, she once said. I think handwritten notes are a lost art form. When I booked my first TV pilot, my dad wrote me a letter that I still have. The idea of someone taking the time to put pen to paper is really special. What is Megan's style? In recent years, Megan has followed three classic style rules, when in doubt, wear a crisp white shirt, embrace British brands, and always keep a simple color palette. The actress also reportedly loves to wear vegan leather, blazers, and button-down blouses. One thing is for sure, Megan has a great fashion sense and always looks stunning. Does Megan like to travel? Yes, which is great because she'll likely be traveling a lot now that she's a member of the royal family. Megan has already visited many parts of the world and once gushed she loves to travel because it feels like a mini vacation. The best way to kill time on a flight is to drink wine and watch movies. It's like a vacation in the sky, she joked.